my impression of Trey Lance. Um, definitely more advanced than Colin Kaepernick was in Kaepernick's first uh, practice. And Kaepernick was 23. Kaepernick didn't have many camper OTAs. It was training camp in 2011. There was a whole, there was a lockout. Um, Kaepernick fumbled snaps repeatedly as a rookie, as a 23 year old rookie. He was coming from a pistol offense in, in college. Trey Lance didn't have any procedural errors. It's not like he, you could see he, he couldn't remember the plays or he couldn't spit them out or he couldn't get the ball from under center. He looked like he'd been on the team a long time. So that's a good thing. Did he look ready? Yeah. He executed the offense flawlessly. There were no penalties on him. He was 20 of 24. He completed his first 12 passes. Um, and what's interesting about him, he didn't scramble once today. Seven on seven, so you can't scramble. It's basically just a passing drill. There's no handoffs, no play action. Just drop back and throw. And there was very few shotgun. A lot of him under center, straight drop backs, like he's Joe Montana, like it's 1985. How often do you see the Niners have under center straight drop backs? Very little. In the, in the NFL now, it's usually if they're under center, it's a run or it's a play action. Anyway, that's what he did most of the day. And he was 20, 24. Pretty good. Pretty good. Now, he's interesting, his style. His average depth of target might have been four yards down the field. It was very much look left, look right, check down. You could see him going through progressions. It wasn't like he knew instantly where to go with the ball, um, which is what, you know, Mac Jones had going for him at Alabama. With Trey, He held on to it longer than really he will be later on. He was holding on to it for a while, and it would be not there, not there, boom. Um, almost a little like what I saw from Justin Fields at Ohio State. That being said, uh, 2024, found the check down repeatedly. Um, it's a good thing. How often do you see Jimmy Garoppolo check down? How much better would Jimmy be if he could just check down? What's interesting about Trey Lance is he's a game manager at heart. He does not jeopardize the football. He doesn't put it in harm's way. He protects the f- football first and foremost. So did Colin Kaepernick. and then. He's accurate. I was curious to see what his accuracy was. Now he threw a lot of short passes. This is basically what he did. He threw the running backs out of the backfield on out routes and he would hit tight ends and wide receivers over the middle. That was Trey Lance. So first takeaway is um, he's ready. And if he's going to be completing, what is 20 to 24? What is that? 80%. If he's going to be completing something like 80% of his passes in camp, Jimmy's got a problem because Jimmy doesn't do that. Jimmy's the kind of guy who'll complete 58% of his passes in camp and be like, well, I'm a gamer. I'm better in the games. Okay. Well, this, this guy is going to be better in games too because he can scramble. You don't really do that in, in practice. No one really practices scrambling. You're there to practice executing. The second reaction plays, that just happens in games. Jimmy doesn't offer that. Trey Lance does. What, what he also offers is apparently excellent uh, uh, practice execution. Jimmy's the kind of guy who throw a pick a day and, and finish with like, you know, 14 to 26, 27. Now, Trey Lance, this is just, this is just against rookies, but he looks like a very good practice quarterback, which bodes very poorly for Jimmy Garoppolo. Very quick feet, um, very strong arm. There were certain times where he felt like he was aiming it when he wanted to let it rip. My God. Really strong arm. Now, I just want to say, it's not all about practice performance. The best practice quarterback I've ever seen is Brian Hoyer. So that's the truth. He was amazing in practice. That guy would let it rip. He would throw bombs down the field. Trey Lance didn't do that. Trey Lance was very conservative. He never threw a pass. That, I don't think he attempted a pass that went more than 15 yards downfield. Keep that in mind. 